What's going on you guys? So check it right. It looks like A Reese isn't letting up on the niggas he once called his homies. And I say that because on his Instagram page he dropped a snippet of an unreleased record where he was talking spicy once again. I mean if I'm analyzing the lines he said on the song correctly, it sounded like he was addressing words once again, as well as addressing his former crew members as a whole. Now on the snippet he first starts off by saying I'm not the kid you remember from back in the day with an innocent image. Nah, ain't doing nothing for free, I'ma need a percentage. I'm giving notice, he not on my level, that nigga is just an apprentice. So Reese is leaving nothing to the imagination. I mean, because Words was a childhood friend of his from back in the day, Reese is letting him know that I'm not that innocent kid you once knew from years back. I'm the big hearted bad guy. I'm the king now. And with that being said, he now knows his worth to the point where he needs a percentage in all the deals he might get into, acknowledging that he isn't doing anything for free. He also states that because he holds a top position in the game, as well as having his own label, he's able to give out orders like a king would indicating that words isn't on his level instead he's just an apprentice who's been learning from him all this time i mean this is reese just echoing the same sentiments he had from kill the king where he spoke on how words wanted to follow in his footsteps of pursuing a career in rap i mean words proclaimed to be the prince whereas reese views himself as the king and is still continuing with that mindset but anyways he still continues by saying hey okay i made a way for you niggas couldn't keep saving you niggas Made a mistake when I did it Flipping the table on niggas Baby boy really a menace I was open and different windows for you niggas Now I'm about to go off the hinges Hey, okay, you came with a squad All I see is a charity case I'm at the top and you not I'm just saying for clarity's sake I make so much money I'm not even thinking about taking a I make so much money I'm not even thinking about taking a break Yeah, that's cause I got so much money I still gotta make now with all these lines it's clear that Reese was referring to his former crew members as a whole. I mean he feels like he put them on and by doing so he also feels like they held him back. He also touches on how it's his turn to flip the table on them considering how most of them trying to paint a certain picture of him being this bad guy who likes playing victim but this time around he's being a menace who's about to go off the hinges which was a clever line by the way but yeah he's off his meds like he stated on straight to hell and it sounds like he's just getting stuck Started with him keeping his foot on their necks at this point I mean he called his former crew members a charity case I guess making fun of some of the members crying about the splits they received when they were still part of the crew I mean if you've been on Twitter you'll see X global constantly throwing a tantrum about him and the crew not getting their fair cut from the songs they did with the boy and Reese just views it as them needing cash to survive now at the same time he flipped the script on words stating that he's at the top whereas he's not which I guess then from words claiming to have hits and the whole of revenge club don't and because reese feels like that it also fits into the theme of him being the king and words trying to kill him now at this current time we're still waiting for a response from words i mean it's been over a month since reese dropped kill the king but at the same time it took reese four months to respond to adam so there's no rush for words to drop at the moment it's just going to be interesting to see when he does plus it's worth mentioning that mash did allude to a response from words being in the works so I guess we need to continue being patient now what I will say last is that this Reese and Kaiser Beats combination is one that I like a lot I mean we all remember what they did on 100 mil right I heard he planning on dropping a diss gender reveal that nigga a bitch I mean it really seems like Kaiser and his beats really bring out the aggressive tone from Reese and I'm here for it Hopefully they drop this record and hopefully there's more to come from them together in the future. But you guys let me know your thoughts on this. What did you make of the snippet if you've heard it? And when do you think words will respond? Comment down below. Anyways guys, thanks for tuning in and I hope you enjoyed. Please make sure to hit that like button if you found the content dope. And hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. It's on to the next one. Peace.